YouTube Nation, I am Average Will and welcome back to the channel and today we are unboxing the May, the May Scout Box. I know we're in July and I'm, I'm now giving to the May, I know, I mean late to the party, I know, uh, but yeah, so you guys have seen me open this on this channel, there's other people that open these on their channels as well. Uh, this is the monthly subscription box. If you subscribe to them, it's $33.99 and then plus shipping. I think it comes to like $41 and change. Um, if you do a one-time purchase, it's $39.99 plus the shipping. Uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm excited with the getting these each month because I'm a huge fan of what Scout puts out between their stuff that recount that just ended not that long ago. Uh, Atlantis wasn't built for tourists. Then you have new books like Locus. Uh, you have the... Um, coming out to a brain fart um <laughs> the black friday uh stuff like that man i am i'm just drawing a blank on all the books so a uh, steak uh and all those fun ones right um a, a lot of great books but it's not just their their scout books or like their um black caravan which are more of their horror themed books they also do stuff that's friendly to younger readers like my son you got the scoop uh that stuff is awesome because there's a lot of stuff. Sengo, is it Sengi? Sengo and Tempo? I'm horrible with the names. That one. Uh, and they have some other ones as well. Uh, that Soul Stream was a fun read uh, for my son. My son who's starting to read. So he's getting into the comics as well with me. And for Scout to put those inside these boxes as well is awesome because I get to enjoy the comics and then I get to enjoy them with my son as well at his level. You know, that are, that are not too crazy that are meant for kids uh, for a younger audience plus they also throw in uh, ash cans I've gotten some awesome ash cans out of here uh, Kilchella I got black cotton um, and, and and those ones so it's really cool to get those rabid world and whatnot so yeah let's get into the May box I think god I can't remember because what they'll do is each month they will change out they, they'll post so it's not necessarily a mystery box they'll post and tell you Hey, these are the issues, the 12 books, or the 12 items that are going to be in the uh, the box every month. Uh, sometimes they'll have the website exclusives because, again, they have, they're a store. They're online and all that. So they'll put uh, stuff on there. They'll put stuff in here that's their uh, online exclusives, the retailer exclusives for them. Uh, I believe, and it could be this one, that's supposed to be like a special foil steak cover. So I'm excited. Oh, and look, right on top of one of the other series that I like, I'm enjoying, it's interesting. Uh, and again, comics is such a great, great platform, especially independent titles. Uh, I've talked about this ad nauseum um, in the past, where I feel like I gravitate more towards the independent titles because I feel like the creators have more freedom. Uh, when you get into uh, the, when you get into the superheroes, Batman, Superman, uh, then you get into like Iron Man, Thor and stuff like that. Creators have to stay in the parameters of those characters, right? You have to kind of stay, you can change some stuff up, but if you want to keep the fan base for those characters engaged, you can't go crazy uh, off the rails with stuff. Whereas independent titles uh, through Scout, Image, uh, Boom and stuff like that, Mad Cave, they have the ability with these independent titles that are five, if they're five issue series, 12 issue mini series, uh, they have an opportunity to bring this whole world to us uh, and, and give us stuff that is exciting and different. And I'm that's what really draws me in to all the independent titles. My pool list at, at my comics shop is, I would say, probably now 90% independent titles uh, and 10% DC slash Marvel. So let's get into these books. So here we go. First is Sam and His Talking Gun, number three. This is another series that is a lot of fun. Um, you don't know, is, is Sam, is he just going a little bit of cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs crazy? Or is his gun literally talking to him? Uh, it's a pretty cool story about some betrayal and everything. First two issues, I really enjoyed it. And again, issue number three. Uh, and they offset them. They offset their, their months. Like it, this title, the titles don't come out every single month, uh, which I like that too. Because again, you're getting different stuff. I know sometimes it could suck because you have to wait an additional month. But 
And then we've got Black Friday number two. This is now over uh, this, again, this is back from, this is the May box and we already have issue number three crazy demons with a Black Friday sale and everything uh, ended with number three. Pretty, pretty interesting story. We got Red Shift number one. Oh, I just looked down and I'm excited for this next thing that I have down here. So we got, that is Red Shift number one. That is one that I did get to my LCS, uh, but now I have, I have a reader copy and a keeper copy just in case this get optioned, right? Who knows, speculate, right? Uh, but this is awesome. Mullet Cop Ash Can. This, this is the stuff I'm talking about. Like, uh, like with Mad Cave. I love how Mad Cave did Terminal Punks and then Hollywood Trash and stuff like that. And then they also have a title like, you know, uh, Nottingham, which is awesome. So again, the different type of stuff. <laughs> Mullet Cop. This is an Ash Can. And what makes it an Ash Can is it's a preview book. So that's pretty cool. Next up, By the Horns number two. This is pretty cool. The um, I think last the the number one we got was their was their store incentive, the online incentive, and then we've got number five of children, right? Children of the Grave. This has been a pretty fun read. It's interesting, and their covers they did a fantastic four homage cover, and uh, yeah, the, the, this cover is pretty cool, man, with the uh, with the tape and everything, and then you got all the skulls dr you know drawn on there, so. And again, if you don't want to pick up the individual issues, if you go, I will link as well. I'm going to link the the boxes, but I'm also going to link Scout's website uh, because you, if you don't want to go and try to pick up these individual issues, if you don't want to pick up a box and you want to check out a story, they sell the trade paperbacks on their site as well. Uh, so you could always go in there and pick up a trade, pick up their other stuff. They do have other mystery boxes as well. They have or boxes um they have the, the deluxe box which is more i think more of a well because i think they tell you everything but they have other boxes they've got a deluxe and then they had like a gold one um around the end of the year last year so we've got ourselves a bookmark nice so this is who let them out swamp dogs this is going to be the ash can for july so this will be in our july box and then it comes out october for or in october is issue number one that's pretty cool. I think that's the first time I've gotten that bookmark. And then, oh, we got another ash can, Broken Souls Ballard. That's cool. So wow, I think this is the first time we've gotten two, I've gotten two ash cans in one box. Pretty nice. Then we got Black Cotton, another title that, I don't know why this one didn't jump right to my front of my head, you know, right off the top of my head, because this is a great series. Uh, Brian Hawkins has been doing an awesome job writing this, uh, and I really like how this has taken the social the the social concept and flipped it. Uh, I think it's a great aspect of seeing, you know, and again, giving you the same tale just from a different point of view, right? So Black Cotton is great. This is number two. I think we're up to number three, and number four comes out in July. Oh, see, and here it is right here. This is a scoop title. This is Miss Adventures. This will definitely be a book that Johnny, Blue Eyes, and I read together. Uh, I'll have him read it to me, and then if there's any words he can't pronounce, I'll help him out. But yeah, so this is, again, this is such a cool little touch. Uh, I know Comic Tom is starting to do it with his July box where he's putting a kid book in each of his boxes, but Scout has been doing this uh, from from the get-go for me since I've been subscribed to them where I get a, we, they, they have all their different titles, right? You get the Black Caravan, you're getting the regular Scout titles, and then you get the Scoot titles as well. Oh, wow, okay, so Midnight Sky. I don't think I've ever gotten one of these ones. Um, so this is pretty cool. I, this, I think this is the first issue I've gotten of Midnight Sky. All right, that's pretty cool looking. And then, oh, here it is right here. We got Steak. This is, I don't know, <laughs> the hollow cover. That is such a kick-ass cover. That is so cool. And this has been a fun, this has been a fun story. Um, it, it's, it's, you got a little bit of that Buffy the Vampire Slayer and Lost Boys action going on. Um, that is a cool cover though. That is definitely a sick cover. And then, oh, how, how can I even forget that this was one? I did not get this through my LCS um, because I think I might have thought I was getting it in the box um, and I wanted to check it out. This is Cherry Blackbird from uh, Joseph Smolke, right, I names, you guys know me with names, I'm horrible with names. 
But uh, yeah, so there we go, Cherry Blackbird. This is definitely one I will be checking out. And again, this is Black Caravan, same with Black Friday. So yeah, that's what we got in the Black, the, uh, the Black, <laughs> that's what we got in the May Scout subscription box. Again, the subscription boxes, if you subscribe, they are $33.99 plus shipping. If you do a one-time purchase, it's $39.99. There are some folks that have discount codes. I unfortunately do not have one yet, maybe, maybe in the future, but I know Comic Burrito, they have one. Uh, so if you want to get something at a discount, uh, I don't remember if it's, I don't know exactly what their discount code is, but you know what? I, don't, I might put it down in the description. I don't know. And maybe one day we'll have a, a discount code. Who knows, right? But uh, again, thank you guys for taking the time to watch this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and slap a thumbs up on it. I appreciate it. Uh, and again, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this. If you're not subscribed and you feel so inclined to, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and make sure you ring that notification bell because it'll let you know when we drop videos, which is every Tuesday and Thursday at 6.30 p.m. Eastern. And then we do a live Wednesday, what we get Wednesday to haul, haul live stream kind of thing. Uh, those are Wednesday at 9.30 Eastern. We have a good time and all that um so yeah thank you so much for hanging out give me a few seconds here at the end of this video as i say thank you to the folks who signed up for my patreon if you want to check out the patreon that'll be linked down in the description as well if you want to follow me on instagram that's down in the description thank you so much for watching i'm average will till next time Amen.